Hey, good morning, everybody. It's 6.41 in the a.m. And I am Pete Direction from LetPetePlan.com, an agent for Boardwalk Travel Agency, here to talk to you a little bit about the parties. Um, first thing off, um, the not-so-scary Halloween party is officially sold out. There are no more tickets available. If you did not get your ticket, um, hope somebody cancels and they open up another ticket because that's about the only way. Or wait until 2024. Um, August of 2024 will come around just like that. Don't worry. Um, but <clears throat> in true Disney fashion, we are going straight from Halloween right into Christmas. And, um, uh, true Pete Trackstrom, um, style, I go from <clears throat> President's Day right into Christmas. Uh, so, uh, usually around March 1st, I start to think about on the next Christmas because March 1st is 300 days away from Christmas. So, and today on August, October, excuse me, October 6th. It is now only 80 days away, so it's getting closer. Um, <clears throat> three things. Jollywood Nights. Um, still, only the first um, party, uh, Jollywood Nights uh, After Hours, uh, is sold out, and that is November 11th. You still have the 18th, 20th. 20th, uh, 27th, and 29th of November, plus the 4th, 6th, 16th, 18th, and 20th of December. Now, notice that there's not that many days when you compare it to the um, Very Merry Christmas Party, but it is there. So... Let's switch over to the Merry Christmas Party, where there are three sold-out dates already, and I will um, get to those real quick. Um, they are uh, the first two, um, the first two nights, and also um, December 14th, which I think is on a Thursday this year. Um, Now, the very first date was actually sold out as early as September 10th, so people are, are wanting to go, and uh, I think now that the, and this is just my opinion, now that they can't get tickets to um, the Not So Scary, they are looking into going to the next big party, which is... The Very Merry Christmas Party. Now, Very Merry Christmas Party start, starts on November 9th. And then there's also one on November 10th. Both of those are sold out. Um, and then you have um, these dates still available. The 13th, 14th, 16th, 17th, 19th, 21st, 22nd, 26th, 28th, and 30th of November. And the 1st, 3rd, 5th, 7th, 8th, 10th, 12th, 15th, 17th, 19th, 21st, and 22nd of December. As I said, December 14th is already sold out. Um, and also November 9th and 10th. Um, <clears throat> if it's anything like the uh, Not So Scary, you'll see some of those earlier ones sell out first and then... And then to more, then the more the more expensive ones will start to start to trigger down. However, the 14th was probably one of the. I don't know. Um, I can't remember what what the pricing was for the 14th of November of uh, December. Excuse me, um, but um, it might have been that time where it cut off between how and and somebody else on. Um, uh, 
Capture the Magic uh, podcast, which I listen to. Hey, I listen to a lot of things um, that are not let people in. <laughs> um, but Capture the Magic um, commented that December 14th sometimes is the beginning of people's vacations. Um going down to disney that's that's a that's a common thing especially those places that get a have kids and that they get um that might be the beginning of their christmas break um i know around here the christmas break doesn't start till like the 21st however we're only an hour and a half away so um we can go earlier than that but um and also, I think that's the same in where I used to be in, in North Carolina. However, as a former educator and also someone who is subbing in the, in the system here, um, <clears throat> that last week of school, most people understand that there's going to be people missing because a lot of people tend to go on vacations at that point in time because they have some time after Christmas um, to go. And some people you know um this was when we would have a lot of people who were traveling maybe even out of the country um because it was a big break and it was also at a time where the weather wasn't that bad um the weather starts to get a little cooler here in um maybe late de december i remember last year um my son and i were at um disney right after Christmas <clears throat> and we were wearing like sweatshirts and stuff it was it got down in the 30s um some um which for Florida is pretty cool you'll start to see people just dressed in their parkas pretty soon um now it didn't stay that way of course all day it it got up into the 50s and maybe even into the 60s that day um I kept my sweatshirt on most of the day I think um but um that's that. And now, speaking of that, they have all the narrators set for the Candlelight Processional. Um, now, I'm, some of these people I've heard of, some of these people I haven't. Um, my wife and I went through them yesterday, um, and um, I asked her who was. Uh, but starting on November 24th through November 25th, we have Chrissy Metz. Uh, she was in, I think, the show This Is Us, um, um, November 26th through 27th, you have Louis Fonzi, uh, November 28th and 29th, I'm going to date myself, wish I could have dated her, <laughs> and Margaret, um, November 30th through the December 2nd, Simu Liu, Liu, um, on a wonderful show called um, uh, out of Canada called um, something about a um, convenience store um, that that's where we first met him and but he was also the latest one of the latest Marvel heroes um, December 33rd through the 5th Uncle Jesse or you know him better as John Stamos uh, Neil Patrick Harris will be there December 6th through the 8th uh, Marley Matlin, December 9th through the 11th. Brendan Fraser, and I know this is, he is new to the, this, um, candlelight processional. This will be his first time, uh, December 12th through the 14th. Um, Eva Longoria, also new to the, um, candlelight processional. December 15th through the 16th. Then you have Joey McIntyre, Sterling, um, K. Brown, uh, Jordan Fisher. Um, uh, December 21st through the 23rd. And then over Christmas, 24th, 25th, and 26th, we have Stephen Curtis Chapman. Um, December 27th through 28th is Audra McDonald. And December 29th, through the 30th, um, Lisa Ling is, is, uh, going to round up, round out the, um, um, 
candlelight processionals, um, and they will be done on December 30th. Um, as I said, uh, Fraser um, is new, so is Fonzie McDonald and Fisher. Um, these these are all new, and then also Metz, who the Chrissy Metz, Eva Longoria. Uh, Joey McIntyre, I thought, had done it before, but I guess not. Sterling K. Brown and and Margaret um, are new to the Candlelight Processional. Well, that is that uh, for... So if you, you find someone you want to hear um, perform um, at the Candlelight... Or, or narrate at the Candlelight Processional, um, make sure you get those dates down. Um, you can look it up on on uh, on your internet. Um, um, Disney, the one that I checked with Disney first, did not have <clears throat> all of them done. But you just have to go and and find Disney announces nine new. Um, <clears throat> excuse me, narrators um, or. Uh, full cat and full cast narrators, and you'll find us. Um, I got a message last uh, yesterday in one of my many Disney um, groups uh, that had the list. Um, so uh, that's all I'm going to say about that. Um, well, here's wishing you a very merry, not so scary, jolly, magical day. And I will see you in the parks.